Hey guys, what's up? Costin here, and today I actually have another fake Pokemon card opening because these things are actually so good. I'm super obsessed, guys. And if you guys have not seen the ones I've done before on this channel, go feel, feel free to check those out because um these these fake cards they're just so cool. I, I think like they're just so awesome, and the fact that the quality is so nice, like. Fake cards are not the same as they were like just a few years ago, and um, I really, really like them. At least in the um, 200 ones I got before, I had like basically all the GXs, but they were missing some newer sets, and so hopefully I can uh, do a lot of those newer sets. Again, like Lost Thunder, up in this box below. Again, um, this is over 200 cards, it says. 200 GX uh, from Lost We have Zero Aura on the front. That Lost Thunder over 200 cards. You have Blaziken and Caesar. Here's a super basic box. So um, I'm super excited to open these. So I know that I believe the quality is going to be a little worse than the ones I had before. So this is an EX. So you know how like, the font is pretty good? Uh, here's a good example. Like This is a good HD image, good um, HD of the font. So I know the font's going to be a little bit weird. I'm just really interested to see what these cards look like. So um, I know they, I'm sort of sad they won't be at the same quality, but the fact that they do have the newer images of the newer Pokemon, I'm, I'm really excited for that. Again, this one also has trainers in them too. Um, so yeah, so also like, I've seen these so, I've seen these cards before. That This is like the other type of fake GXs. The GX boxes I got before is one type, and this one I believe right now is just a different type. And by the looks of it, the backs are a little bit different. The backs look worse. Oh, wait, I'm stupid. I'm blind. I'm blind, dude. Because there's a piece of tape right here. There we go. We got the cards. Wow. Here we go. Let's just keep, take a look at the back real quick. Um, The backs are super glossy. Uh, They're not... They're, they're pretty great. But I, you can easily tell, unlike the other ones. And these are just super choppy. I can see people liking these, but I believe the ones... The formula, the formula right? The cards I had before were a lot better. So, we've seen these cards before, but it's, it's just a different type of fake cards. Espan GX. Man, they feel pretty good. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put these in sleeves later on and see what they feel like, but Primarina GX. Um, look, why is that in red text? Hello, sir. Sir, why is that in red text? So, I know the font's a little bit different. <laughs> look, it's not an ability, it's attack. So, they, they mess up that part. But, as you can see... The, at least the images are really good, at least for these GXs. I'm interested in seeing the newer GXs from like Lost Thunder and um, Celestial Storm. The Those GXs I'm interested in. Uh, also, these are really light. And also the infamous green Lapras and that weird font. <laughs> That's going to be a little bit getting used to. But um, yeah, at least these these, these GXs, um, they're not off cut. It's just that the borders are pretty big. Um, wow, that's a, that's a lot oranger than I thought it'd be. Tauros, Umbreon, Lunala. Lunala also has a super thick border, so... Oh, I think these are also a little bit smaller. Let's just take this Marshadow again, for example. And look how good those backs are. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, they are a little bit smaller. So, I, I, can, I can just tell by uh, feeling it. But going back to Decidueye and Tauros... At least these images look pretty great at Toxpecs GX. So, as I said before, oh man, that like that's actual that's an actual drawing. That's actually really good. I still way prefer those old GXs from those boxes, the boxes with the Pokeballs on them. But um, at least you do, you do get a lot of good images. Like the the texts are all work, right? Um, they're exact one to one. That's English text. The font might be a little bit different. The cards might be a little smaller, so like it's gonna be and feel a lot different. But um, just as the images show me right now, they look pretty great. Yeah, Metagross, Drumpa, Drumpa GX. Got another stack, another stack. The Sidui, looking. Oh, look, look at this. The Sidui lacks the. Uh, <laughs> there's no typing for that one. Yeah, so these ones have like this is like the classic fake card stuff. I mean, like these are excellent fakes, no doubt. These are like greater fakes than I had when I was a kid, but they still aren't perfect. The ones that I opened before, man, those are actually those are so good. But um, at least I these are all reprints. Uh, when I say reprints, like I already have uh, fake cards of fake fake cards of these cards, right? Of these Pokemon, and these are all stuck together. 
the Alga GX and the Full Art Alolan Golem. And this one I actually don't have yet because it didn't come with the other one, but um, Zygar GX uh, Full Art. Hey, uh, I don't know what set this from, but also this is sort of what we're talking about where like these newer ones, so from the older um, Sun and Moon sets, they have that kind of font. While the newer ones, you get like uh, this one from Shining Legends. It has that really big font. I don't know why. It looks sort of jarring, but um, images look really great. So there's Zygarde. I feel like the the thing I'm just complaining about the most. Okay, that's that, uh, that's sort of weird. Uh, the things I'm complaining about just the most is um, I mean they feel fine. They're sort of slick, but that's something you just get used to. But um, the fact that they're just sort of smaller I, I can feel them they, they, these feel like Yu-Gi-Oh cards Palka GX oh yeah this is the, this is the one that's a uh, water type and Greninja nice these are ones I don't I actually don't have yet Feromosa Lucario with the, again that weird font it takes getting some used to but at least that artwork guys that rainbow where I know there's no texture but that rainbow where Xerneas looks amazing they look so good not gonna tell. So we're getting to uh, newer sets that um, newer sets newer than Ultra Prism, which was the other one that was just limited to. So you have Not gonna tell. These cards are stuck to each other. Palkia, this is from Ultra Prism Zoroark from Shining Legends. Evato, that's new. Dialga, Dragon type. Ultra Necrozma, that's nice. That's nice. Silvalli, Silvalli. Celestila, Buzzwool. We have some um, Crimson Invasion cards here. Necrozma. Man, there you you can just feel guys, they're just stuck. This is a rainbow rare, but it also has that fighting background, so sort of weird. Sort of sus. Greninja, rainbow rare. That's beautiful. Zerkatry. The font takes getting some used to, and also it feels it feels weird. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it feels weird. Dawnwing, Necrozma, and Nihiligo. Man, so I I really do like the holographic pattern, so Another good thing is that while I put this card back in its sleeve, another good thing, again, this is a fake card, by the way, another good thing is that the holographic patterns, they look pretty great. Like, they look, they have that great shine to them, uh, something that I really do much enjoy a lot. So, I know uh, this one, uh, this box, actually, from eBay, it said that it came with, like, 170 GX, 20 energy cards, and, like, 10 full art trainers, so... Um, these are my first chance of actually seeing some full art trainers because I know there's a bunch of fake ones online. I just never really like wanted to buy them, but um, we can take a look see right here. So we have Underground Expedition. Honestly, these the art looks really nice. Bill's Maintenance. Like uh, you guys can't, you guys. Woo! I the TV reporter. The art's in HD. The card's shiny. There's no texture, but that's still fine. Steven's Resolve. We have Copycat. Blaine's Last Stand, Zinnia, Ap Apricorn Maker, Apricorn Maker, and now we are on to uh, some newer GXs that I'm really interested in. So we have Shiftery GX, Full Art, Articuno GX, Rayquaza GX, Rainbow Rare, Caesar Rainbow Rare, Tyranitar GX, Ooh. Caesar GX. Uh, Electro is like literally one of my favorite Pokemon. I know the design is terrible, but that was one of the main reasons why I wanted to buy this so much because, um, Electro has a GX, and I'm super excited about that. Rayquaza, Caesar again. These are onto the full arts. The regular GX is Bennett GX, Shiftry GX. And also Mr. Mime, which is like the same artwork from the Mr. Mime EX. I love how they did that. Articuno, we have more Shiftry, more Bennett. Reshiram, Altaria from Dragon's Majesty. White Curum. Onto the latter half. So I think this is where the energy start. This is a part. Uh, you can just see how choppy it is, guys. But we have Blaziken GX Full Art, Salamence GX, Woo. Stack Attacker, we have the Rainbow Rare, we have Dragonite from Dragon's Majesty, Stack Attacker, Bennett again. Do we have, do we get another one of these? I can't tell if we just got the um, Full Arts yet. But Altaria again, Wycurum Full Art, Rainbow Rare, Kingdra, Reshiram again, Blaziken, Electro. So the box did say. Over 200 Pokemon cards, but then the listing on eBay said that it was 200 exactly. So, obviously, you guys can count. I might just count them in the future. And also, Shuckle. Shuckle is so sick. I'm gl so glad 
they gave him a GX. That's so sick. Plus Cephalon. Plus Cephalon. Okay. And then Zero Aura from the box. We pulled the cover card. That's great to see. Mac Cargo, Verizion. And then we actually do have the Gold Rare Ultra and the Charisma. Now that's pretty. That's pretty. I really like that. Again, another picture on the back. You can just tell straight away that these are non legitimo non-legitimate. Salamence. And now we have the energy cards. Break some. I mean, I'm uh, energy cards are energy cards, but I still love to have hol actual holographic energy cards. That's something like, I think everyone wants. But Splash Energy. Flash Energy. Danger Energy. Wonder Energy. Shield Energy. Strong Energy. Herbal. Double Dragon. And then the Double Dragon. What the hell? <laughs> All right, they also messed up here. You guys can also tell that this is a double colorist, but they they said it as double dragon. That just that just sort of sucks. I'm like, how do you guys do that? All right, then we have the holographic energies that you find in um, evolutions, I believe. So grass, dark, and also these look these look pretty good. Like if I had a lot of these, I would totally just run them in like a deck. I mean, because energies are energies. No one's gonna really care, but um. Especially not in tournament, but just like hanging out with your friends. Woo! Or oh, just playing with your friends. These cards look nice. Of course they are. Burning and Mystery. Alright. Now we're on to, I guess, some Sun and Moon GXs again. I'm pretty sure we might get more gold, but we'll see. Lunala GX again. Weird Font again. Dustman Necrozma. Sogaleo. Zergatry again. Zygarde. Glaceon, Kartana. The order of these cards is just so weird. Greninja again. And then we do have some gold. We do have some gold. We have the Lunala. And what comes off is the Solgaleo. So we have triple, triple gold. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to see, guys. And closing this off, we have more Xerneas. I'm pretty sure they, ma they might have had a promo. That's why I'm like seeing doubles here. Celesteela, Palkia, Dusk, Wings. Of I, might ha I might have seen this card again, too. These Again, I... I <laughs> I'm going to have to watch, we watch this video. Guzzlord. Leafeon. Gyarados. One more. Yveto and Buzzwall. So, overall review. These card images look obviously brilliant. Not going to lie, they look so nice. They feel pretty good. Uh, I mean, they're a little bit short, but um, that's something I can easily oversee. The font, however, is sort of jarring. Like, you can just tell. Anyone can tell. Like, so... Any of these cards, right? Whether they're EXs or whatever, they, they're exact one to ones, right? Which I really do appreciate because, again, like I like looking at the actual one. -to -one. I mean, like they are sometimes a little um, off centered, but nowadays Pokemon cards are like they're almost all off centered. But they do have a different style to them. I mean, I'm glad that they are doing the newer Pokemon sets because I do want to have like fakes of like a lot of Pokemon cards, but. Um, would I buy them? Probably yes, because it's like the only option right now. Um, if I can find another company, basically, that's like making better ones, like I'll probably go review them too. But um, this one's also off-centered a bit too. I'll send it on the front, but not the back. I believe all the backs are the same. But um, hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm like really interested. I love. I would love to show you guys more and more about... Um, oh, I really want to see if they if they sort of stubbed me with my Rainbow Rare or Full Art Shuckle. I have to go see that again. But um, yeah, I, I'm really interested in this fake Pokemon content. So if you guys liked it, feel free to give a like down below and comment. Any questions you have of things you want to see in the channel in the future, I'm, I'm really enjoying what I'm doing right now. I'm just doing a bunch of random stuff that I really like and enjoy. So hopefully y'all are enjoying it too. And I think that's it, guys. Double costing out. What's up, guys?